Hello, my friends, and welcome back to the Deep Tarot. This is a reading for Venus sign in Cancer. If your Venus sign is in Cancer, this is your love reading. Everything you need to know about the schedule of the channel is in the description box. Keep in mind, this is a general reading, so it may not resonate with all of you, and energy could be vice versa. I'm going to tell you a short story, and you decide who is who in the story. If you are new, please subscribe and hit that notification button. So each time I post something new, you will be notified. And if you can hit like, share, and comment, thank you so much for doing that. I have three jumping cards in here. I will read this energy, then I will start my reading. The Moon, Temperance, and the Queen of Pentacles. This is a story of somebody in life. You were so a lot afraid in the past. Most of the time you try to hide things from people because because you were so afraid to face people with reality or how you feel or what you want in your life. And that was an, a big obstacle in your life, stopped you from reaching your goals because you didn't know how to defend yourself based on this fear, not knowing how to put a healthy boundaries between you and others. Right now, you are this temperance energy. You healed yourself from this, my dear. And I believe this will take you to the Queen of Pentacles, that grounded, solid, mature energy, financially, emotionally, in the, like, mentally as well, in every aspect of your life. You learned your lesson and you are this balanced energy with this temperance here and you reach this stability in life or you are about to reach that i can see the ace of cups here and this is the unconditional love that will enter your love your life based on this healed energy that you have if this reading is your reading my dear congratulations you did the work and you are ready for happiness in life the real happiness, not the lies. Let's see, my dear. Let's see, Cancer. This is your person, personality. Wow, this is the Queen of Pentacles. It seems there is somebody healed coming to your life. It's time for the real deal. This is how they feel about you, the hermit. How they see your energy or your personality, how they see your appearance. Is this individual from the past or new? What's their intentions towards you? What they want to do, what they will do, and one outcome. And I will take the oracle card and I will start my reading. The previous reading is telling you, my dear, that you will have a balanced, grounded, mature energy entering your life. And this will be your way out of this heartbreak. This individual is very grounded, mature, independent unrequired love there is not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going this is from your side my dear and this is not about chemistry or attraction this is what you are convincing yourself because you are afraid of this energy you know that this individual is here to stay they are touching areas you don't want to touch because of that you are trying to push them away well, this reading is telling you this individual is not going anywhere. This is, this individual is sended by the divine to your life to come out of this. How they feel about you, the hermit. This individual knows that this is a healing process with you. You are a mission in their life. This individual knows that knows that they are in your life because they will be the reason for you to heal. Maybe this is 
a spiritual individual, somebody with healing uh, energy, they know themselves and they know what they are doing here and they know what's their life purpose here. Because of that, I'm telling you, they are not going anywhere. You are trying to push this individual aside because as I told you, they are going in areas in your life you don't want to go. You are ignoring something and they are bringing that something to the light because it's time to release the pain. How they see your personality. The queen of swords. This individual sees you as a very protected, cold energy. You are afraid. You are putting everything has to do with feelings in a solid metal box close it and keep it in that deep 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 freezer inside you you are not ready to think even about emotions how they see your appearance this individual knows that you are attracted to them and they know that you are watching them and This individual knows that you are afraid of love because of that you are watching but you are not coming close and you are always showing your sword while they are around. Not because they are bothering you, because you are bothering you. What you are feeling is bothering you. You are trying sometimes, this reading is for someone very defensive towards this energy till the point that I believe sometimes... Maybe you will be a little bit aggressive, pushing them away. Very sharp in your words, in your way of dealing with them. But this individual, as I told you, they understand. And they are here with a plan. They know what they are doing. Is this person from the past or new? I don't feel this is a past person. This person is bringing conflict to your life. Not because of what they will do. The conflict here because of what you are feeling. This is the conflict. You are losing your mind from this situation. You are trying, I believe, unintentionally to do everything you can to push this individual away. From your life. You don't want them around. You don't want them. As I told you. This individual is touching. A place. You tried. To ignore for a very long time. You are freezing your heart. Like your emotions. Because your heart is not ready to work. There is three swords in your heart and you are not ready. You don't, you don't have the ability to love right now and you don't want to heal this aspect of your life because you know if you will go this to this area in your, inside you, the pain will be more than you can handle. This individual, what's their intentions? The Three of Swords. This individual is here to pull these swords away from your heart and heal this heart after a very long time. I'm not feeling you at this time bleeding because of these swords. But this heart recovered with the swords inside it. Like you built an energy of stopping the bleeding while the swords is there. Meaning you are numb. There is some, this area in your life is not working. This individual here to heal your heart properly. The Three of Swords is the healing of this situation is not about stopping the, the, the bleeding. It's about healing the heart and remove the swords. You stopped the bleeding, but you didn't heal yourself. 
it's time to open these wounds one more time to clean them and let them heal the right way, not your way. What's their intentions towards you? The Queen of Cups. This person is in love with you, real love with you. They want to be in love with you, to have a real relationship with you based on two elements the water and the and earth reality with love what they will do for the time being this person is holding back they will not approach you aggressively because you are not ready for them to enter this individual will be patient with you and they will try to build the trust between you and them and they don't care how long this will take. This individual, as I told you, is in your life for a mission. Being in this energy will not help you. Trying to show them that there is no enough attraction or chemistry will not work. Don't pretend. I am not telling you that you are in love with them. But you are attracted to them. And you are trying to kill this inside you and to push them as far as you can because of this. You don't want. Well, it's time, my dear. As I always say, there is always aspects in our life need healing, need change. The universe will give us enough time to change it. If we will not do the job, they will do the job for us. And this is the job. This is the mission. This individual is here to accomplish a mission. And they will. Let's see the outcome. The Page of Pentacles. This individual is holding a real, tangible beginning with you. They are slow because this is the pace that you can handle they cannot go faster because you are not ready for that this individual is here to change your life my dear give them the chance you stayed in this queen of swords for a very long time it's time for you to come back to life and feel happiness surrender to the divine surrender to life and stop fighting your happiness. Well, this is what I have for you, my dear. I hope this was a helpful reading. Thank you so much for all the love and the support. Have an awesome day. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.